Oh hey, what is up guys? This is Matt Paulino and um Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> Let's go. So we started our journey with the 4 o'clock call time and made our way to the airport. I think it's better if we Yo, change. hello. So we are all you so right now we just um are up we're at the airport, it's like six and where are we going? We're going well no, I mean where are we going now? Uh gate one one zero. So, hey guys, are you excited? Yeah, really excited. Okay. <laughs> hey George, are you excited for the uh, super? The <laughs> super excited. Like, hey Matthew, actually we are very excited. Today we're with Chris Carson. How are you, Chris? Doing good. Too. Very thank you. Very thank you. So <laughs> feeling good. <laughs> so um, right now we are on the plane and we are going to uh, Beijing. And, uh, yeah. But then, we had issues. Hi, so I'm gonna tell you a quick story. So, um, our flight delayed from Manila to Hong Kong for about an hour. So we were like, okay, whatever. I mean, we're still gonna have time. But then, we arrived at Hong Kong and we were like, oh, boarding's in 10 minutes. So we ran across the whole airport. We made it like, like five minutes ago. And turns out they didn't even start boarding yet. So. That's great. <laughs> Luckily, we were productive. Hey guys. So, update. Um, so you know how we were running to our gate because we were like, oh, we're going to miss our, our flight, whatever this, that. Our flight actually got delayed an hour and 45 minutes. Oh. So, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> Hi guys. It's <laughs> 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 Olivia, how does the food taste? Good. Hey guys, so um, we just arrived in uh, Beijing. It's like five right now. And, yeah. Hey guys, so we are um, at. <laughs> Can you guys speak? Where are we, guys? We are at ISB. Oh my god. After the late night. We're not with ISB. Very well. Yeah, we're gonna try our best. Yes! Yes, that's what he meant. We got you. And for the, yes, sportsman. Yeah, nice. Yes. And for first. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even late. <laughs> So when we arrived, we were all pretty tired. So with that, we headed to our homestay to get prepared for the big days ahead of us. And then, it was showtime. Hello. Hey. So right now it's around like 12 o'clock. 
It's like around 12 o'clock on the first day and we're doing good. Girls and boys won oh. this is medley really. Yeah. And I think girls won both of that. Did the boys I don't know. Did you guys um yeah. Did you guys break the record for DMR? Okay, okay so, so we think so but we're not too sure. Yeah, so uh, boys and girls and yeah, um, probably broke the record and then Nico won first for her triple jump. Yeah. Got gold. Cool. She's wait. Yeah. There's no final? Oh, she she did the final. Okay, she got so, 10 30 Oh, so she she um Yeah, she, she was won. the only one who reached 10. Wow. She said. Sorry. And that's all folks. I, that's all. That's all for we'll today. Update you after finals. After lunch. Do we expect the update to be lit? AF because I'm gonna get first place. Yes! Whoa there! It's Do a lot it. of confidence, Ru. We didn't really feel much after that, but you're probably wondering what happened. Well... Boys won both the championship and the sportsmanship award, while the girls did an awesome job getting second and um, also getting the sportsmanship award. Yeah, nice. Additionally, a heap of school and APAC records were broken, and um, a plethora of bronze, silver, and gold medals were taken. It was a really awesome experience. And that's a wrap for APAC Track and Field 2019. Ah!